Judge Judy, everybody. Uh, you got... You have a ponytail happening. Isn't it wonderful being liberated with this? You don't have to worry about things. You know, you get up in the morning. What happens? Yes. Yeah, I have really short hair, so I don't have to worry, worry about, about much. It. So you just added a ponytail to yours. Well, now, now my actual ponytail is actually pretty reasonable because it's been growing for a year. So I get up in the morning and I feel like Greta Garbo. Wait, you that's your Greta... hair? Yeah, that's... Just a second. They don't know who no, Greta Garbo is. No, they don't know who Greta have... Garbo is. <laughs> oh, my they God. Think... No, no, they don't know who that is. Elizabeth Taylor? Nope. <laughs> All right, all right. Ariana Grande. <laughs> um, all <Who's> right. That? <laughs> you don't know who that is. Yes, you know who yes, that I is. Do. Of course I, you do. I do. Yes, you're, you're very hip. Yes, you, I do. Um, so I want to show a picture of you and your husband. Is this how you get around all the time, or where are you in this picture? <laughs> I didn't know what to get him for his 85th birthday. And I figured, what greater gift could there be for somebody at 85 than a motorcycle? <laughs> but I actually love him, so I got him a tricycle. So it right. has three wheels, and he's only allowed to drive it within the parameters of the gates where we live. He's not allowed to cross traffic, although I've actually seen him trying to steal around crossing over right. double lane traffic. But he keeps pretty much to himself and the gym and back to the house. Did he want a motorcycle? I asked him. I mean, I wasn't about to invest $40,000 right. in something that right. he didn't want. That's not and bad. 40000 for that? That's, yeah. That's not a bad price for a tricycle. It's not bad. And when, you go, <laughs> and when you go to the place that we bought it, Jerry, what's the name of the motorcycle that you have? What's the name of the... Harley Davidson. Harley Davidson. Of course, Harley what's Davidson. What's the name of the... When you went to the... We went to the Harley place. I cannot tell you how fabulous it was. It was the size of a city block, and everybody sort of hangs out there in leather. You and then there was us. <laughs> yeah. Um, all right, so tell me this. Um, 25 seasons, this season or next season is 25 seasons? 25 seasons next year. Next year. Our best year. And, and every year is the best year. I could, watch all, I could watch your show all day long. They're all entertaining. Every year is the best. But what ha So that's your last year? Well, I've had a 25-year-long marriage with CBS. Mm -hmm. And it's been successful. Next year will be our 25th season, silver anniversary. And CBS, I think, sort of felt they wanted to optimally utilize the repeats of my program, because now they have 25 years of reruns. So what they decided to do was to sell a couple of years' worth of reruns. Mm -hmm. But I'm not tired. So Judy Justice will be coming out. What? The year later. Where? I can't tell you yet. Oh. <laughs> well, that's exciting. So you're moving. That's exciting news. That's exciting news. Judge Judy, you'll be able to see next year, full year, all new shows. With a but ponytail. With a ponytail. <laughs> with a ponytail. The following couple of years, you should be able to catch all the reruns that CBS has sold to the stations that are currently carrying Judy. OK. And Judy Justice will be going elsewhere. Judy, Isn't that fun? Wow. So you just changed the <laughs> It is fun. Isn't that fun? Yeah, it is fun. <laughs> you know how much fun you, that was? Yes, I bet. I bet. <laughs> you betcha. Because you changed it to Justice, because <laughs> it's a different name. Yeah. And you get to still keep doing what you're doing. I love that you're not tired. I love that you're going to keep doing this. That's fantastic. Yeah. If you're yeah. not tired, you're not supposed to stop. We talked about that the yeah, last time over here. I and since then, you've made about six new, diff new programs. Yes, I, I have things. I have a lot of things that I like to do. Juggling. I keep, I keep busy, you know? It's Me fun to keep busy. Me too. All right, we're taking a break. We'll be back more with Judge Judy after this. One thing that we both, I, and I hope everybody is, is uh, concerned with, is uh, the election year that we're in, and everybody needs to vote. No matter what you want to vote for, everybody needs to vote. Yeah, got it. Uh, get out get, there. Get out Rain and vote. Shine. And so you've never been uh, political. You've never you know, stepped into the uh, arena before. But now this year, you are. I did. The only person who I knew who had governed a community with a population that was larger than 36, the population of 36 states in the United States and governed it through 9-11 and governed it through 
a financial crisis, and with distinction. This country needs a calm, stable, sure-footed leader. And the only one out there that can do that is Mike Bloomberg. So I want you to vote as Ellen does. I think Mike Bloomberg's the guy. But as long as you vote, it's your prerogative. I love America. I want it to be the way it is. All right. All right. I'm not clear, but it seems like you like Bloomberg. I, I, <laughs> am I getting that right? I do. All right, all right. <laughs> Judge Judy airs weekdays. Check your local listings. We will be right back. Judge Judy, everybody. <laughs> <laughs>